of uh, Transport Fever 2 on a megalomaniac map. Um, right, so uh, there's been no time progression since the last time. Uh, what I what I'm going to do this time is uh, look at uh, bringing in uh, con mats to uh, uh, Mick Allen, uh, and I think I think that's the, the right thing to do here since the con mats are so close. It's so convenient uh, that. Uh, uh, that uh, might as well. So we got a stone train coming in here at the Conmats factory, and uh, we've got some wagons coming in to pick up Conmats. So, yeah. Um, okay, so the platform is not overloaded. Okay, uh, right, so what I'm going to do over here is I'm actually going to bring it into, I'm going to bring it into, you know what, I'm going to bring it into this existing train station and then truck it up into wherever the con mats need to go up there. Okay, so that means we need to configure the station. Uh, and I'm going to need a cargo platform with a track. Now I'm thinking, nope, I'm not going to need a through platform for passengers there. So uh, so I'm, I'm not going to be doing a through line for passengers, so I don't need to worry about that. So we'll add cargo platforms here. Well, we don't have to for the cargo. Um, now, I'm going to add a cargo building, which I'm going to put where am I going to put it? Well, what I want to find out is where uh, where the con mats need to go. Where do the con mats need to go? Over there. Ah, it's all over there. Okay. Right. So if we put this in here. Yep. I'll put the station there. And then that means I need to come out on this side. Okay. I will put a cargo building a medium one over here and I will grab a truck station over here no I, I need to get rid of that first then I need one of these which I'm going to point this way there we go and I need a street coming out right Okay, well, now I need a line here. Need to make sure to click, whoops, wrong, 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 wrong. Need to make sure to click on the right station. OK, 
Okay. And this is going to be cargo delivery from McAllen in McAllen uh, Conmat. Okay. Now I need to get the cargo. Okay, now I'm going to get into the the double tracking situation here. Okay, I need a second uh, platform here. Okay, so now this is the really nice thing on uh, Transport Fever 2 is that you can uh, expand stations without demolishing and rebuilding them. Now I need to put some track in. So this will bring it out over the road. And it's going to need to head off this way. Um, I'm going to need to actually be able to build the track. Right. Uh, this will need to go off this way. This is going to be one of those things where I'll have to come back later and uh, rejigger it big time. But anyway, uh, I need to uh, get this uh, track going here. this. I might as well just double track this part since that's where we need to go and I want to keep the uh, freight line mostly separated from the uh, passenger line but this part I will run as an actual dual track operation, which means what I need a crossover here and up here. Uh, wait, wait, I can double slip that. Yes, now this will mean I need some signals. So we'll need a signal there and a signal here and for efficiency I think I'll put a couple more pairs uh, so right about like so and then a uh, two-way signal coming off of all of those options. Right. And I'll need this also. Now we'll try it this way. There we go. Um, right. Now I need another line, which will go from here to here. Yes. And this will be cargo Long Beach Conmat to McAllen distribution. Okay. Now 
I need a train. And we'll go with the Baldwin again. And we need uh, we need a, a state car, right? Yeah. That would be the one. Four or five. Um, that might be too many. Well, it's definitely too many because we can't afford it. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we'll go with that. Buy it. Put it on that line. Then we need to come over here. And we need. Yeah. And I think. Two. And we'll put those on. Uh, here. Okay. Now let's uh, follow this one. We'll turbo it. Now the question is whether this actually makes money or not. Uh, that's going to be uh, that's going to be the critical question. It'll take a little while to bed in, I think. Oh, we've got some to take back, so so that's a good sign. Ah, eh, the train's running mostly empty, of course. Oh, we're saving. I back off the frequency of the autosave, but the game is still just a little bit crashy for my liking. So, uh, as a result, I've left the autosave. Although, it's less annoying than it was in... Uh, uh, transport fever one where uh, what would happen is uh, the autosave would happen and everything including the UI would freeze uh, they've improved that in uh, this version so you can actually do things like move around the map and so on when the autosave is going on so that's a definite improvement okay we're coming in for a landing here we got like nothing for two con mats. And we're heading back. And the passenger train's still working, so that's a good sign. Off we go. Uh, a bit of a frame rate issue there. Uh, so what? Okay, we can... Now, if I didn't have the smoke reduction mod, sitting here like this would mean we'd be looking at basically a smoke screen. Uh, right, so over here we've got, well, we've got a fair number there to pick up. So we're taking a mostly full load back. Uh, and this plot, the platform is in fact overloaded. So I'll uh, deal with that in a bit. Uh, that may mean that I need more uh, wagons on that line. Obviously, uh, this this is going to have the same issue, actually. So, 
uh, what I will do is add extend the uh, cargo platform here so that these two um, wagons have uh, a chance to pick the stuff up without it overloading the uh, platform. You're going to dump 30 straight onto there, right? So, oh, right, I can, there we go. And in comes the wagon. There we go. So I suspect that I'll need more uh, more wagons on that, but I'm not entirely certain. Now here, I will configure and add a cargo platform here. Yeah, it was definitely overloaded. So, I'm going to add another five vehicles on that. So that should be able to keep up. Now, this isn't keeping up. So, this... Uh, manage, edit the consist, I need to add, need to extend the consist there. Okay. Uh, and that's about all I can afford to do right now. But we pick up 105 stone to, uh, take back so may take a while but it will get there yeah I think this is uh, this is probably going to work so I'll bring this up uh, so the road vehicles are coming out ahead. The trains are just about breaking even, and when that uh, stone train arrives, they will. Okay, here's the stone train. 450k, so yeah. It does look like they may have uh, corrected some of the queuing issues where the vehicles would stack, but I'll have to uh, observe longer to be sure. Well, there we go, a full train going back. I may need to extend the consist on that one as well. But really, at this point, uh, there's not much I can do other than uh, wait for the game to uh, progress and the odd bit of micromanaging. Uh, we're coming up on the end of June, so the end of the quarter. 
So basically where we're at is our operational budget is balanced and the capital budget is, well, the capital budget. So, oh yeah, this is going to put us positive for pretty much the whole year. We had the passenger train, I think, arrive and the stone train. So, yeah, definitely. Um, so it looks like our actual uh, delivery operations are, in fact, profitable. So, now I need to look over here. Are these two uh, wagons keeping up? And it looks like they are. These, however, are not. Uh, manage vehicles. Well, I think... Whoops. I meant to duplicate those. What a moron. Okay, and I think I'll have to do that over here as well. No. Nope. No. Nope. Uh, this is... Uh, this is keeping up. Okay. Although... No. I think perhaps... I should extend that platform. And maybe do the same here. No, maybe I didn't need the extras. Maybe I just needed to extend the platform. Yeah, I'll do that. And then... Right, because the platform couldn't handle the full influx of uh, passengers from the train. I think that was the problem. Either way, I think, no, I think I may, may, be, it may have been well employed uh, uh, adding uh, vehicles there. Uh, yeah, so we uh, came out 780k positive in Q3. Uh, and when a train arrives, this will turn around. Okay, so yeah. Okay, well I'm going to repay a million on the loan there. Uh, and over here, let that run for a little bit. Looks like I may need a second stone train, which would mean dual tracking between here. Yeah. So I'm going to have to let the uh, money pile increase for a bit before I can do that. But I guess, as you can see, it uh, it's not that difficult to make money and to make ridiculous looking track setups. Uh, you know, realistically, 
I don't actually need this track set up anymore. So why don't I remove it so I don't have to pay maintenance on it? Yeah, that would be a good idea. Because I was paying 60k in maintenance and tracks, so if I can knock a little bit off that. Okay. Well, this is looking like a proper town. Uh, we're up to... F Whoa! We're up to 475 already? Well, 456. Uh, right. I think the next thing to do, what do tools need? Uh, tools, tools. Don't have a tools factory nearby. Tools. It wants uh, planks. Okay. Well, I could do that actually bring in tools to Long Beach as well. Yeah, that might be the thing to do, actually. Uh, so that, that I think, would be the next project. Uh, I guess uh, uh, connect up this forest up to this uh, sawmill, and then the sawmill over to the tools factory and oh look Santa Ana takes con mats as well uh, and tools so so if I connect that chain up I can deliver to uh, Long Beach so that might be the project for next time around actually uh, taking a look um, yeah there's a, a good chance of that. I'm going to repay some loan while I, I'm thinking about it. Uh, yeah. Uh, that will be the, uh, the next uh, process, I think, is uh, uh, connecting, connecting up a, a tools production. Now over here, uh, we're not quite shipping everything that we can, so I think I'll need uh, I'll need one more train on that line, and then it'll be a matter of balancing the wagons. Yeah, uh, yeah. So next time around probably balancing this a bit more and getting a, a tools operation up here up and running and delivering to Long Beach meanwhile how's this doing well we're up to 344 population there so that's good um, yeah uh, I, there's not really much more I can do here. Uh, well, I have enough loan that I can start working on something now, so so I guess there's that. Anyway, 
uh, I think I'm going to call it here uh, next time around, uh, bringing on a another uh, another uh, goods line. Uh, even though I said at the beginning, I think that I was going to focus on passengers, uh, this map just set up too too well uh, not to do it this way. So uh, so there you go. Uh, let's. Uh, is there anything cool to look at on the way out? Well, let's let's take a boo in here. see things operating here yeah I clearly need to expand the uh, conmats going to McAllen there uh, so there we go uh, that's uh, that's all for this time uh, see you back next time